Hello and welcome everybody, this is your host Leo Vak, and you are just in time for more Tron 2.0. So yeah, in the last episode we made it here and we destroyed it and we uh, destroyed a modulator socket. In this episode we're going to be doing much uh, the same. Um, we're going to destroy another one. I think we only have this last one to destroy. Um, Uh, or disrupt, rather. Um, so I want to go. And be careful, I don't want to fall off and take damage, though. Of course, that. Of course, taking the guy point blank and missing. <laughs> um, come on. There we go. One last one to destroy, right over here. And let's go ahead and so we got that destroyed, so all I gotta do is head for the exit port, which crud. And I gotta remember where the exit port is. <sighs> more of the security resin station. Again, I have to apologize. I I'm sorry if my voice sounds a little different than it normally does. I'm kind of working through the uh, the down a cold or something. I'm not entirely sure. Like my nose stopped up, but everything else is fine. <coughs> no, aside from the coughing, but regardless, figured now would be as good a time as any to let, do a let's play because I haven't I've done like what. Four or five episodes this month. First, I configure the. Um, no, that's tried right. making sure to do other things, First, obviously. I'll the rings, then, then configure them. Yeah, but I do want to eventually right. finish this and get on. Mm, I'm talking to myself. Move on to other games. You want a job? Oh yes, I'm quite nervous. You'll do just fine. If you don't, the data rates will simply de-res you. Huh? Oh, that's reassuring. First, I line the rings, then I configure them. Sounds easy enough. And how, like? What's the configuration, though? What, why do we, like, how do we configure them? What was that? Ah, crud. What was that? Ah! For stupid scanner. Oh, this is... Okay. One thing I will say, this game roll, it is a, uh... Okay, so I guess we go through here. Well, it is a, uh, an earlier game. It is one of those games that tries to uh, push stealth a little bit. It doesn't do a good job of the stealth element. It's like, uh, what was it? Strife, I think, had like some, some minor stealth elements in it. Um, Okay. Hmm. Okay, there we go. That's that. So we have 300 health, uh, or 300 energy, uh, maxed out. So I think we're going pretty good for ourselves so far. Um, we gotta find one of the security. There we go. Go ahead and quick save real quick before entering. Oh, this is... Oh... Oh, it's one of those puzzles. Okay. That's gonna hurt us, I think. So we gotta get through when we have a chance. So yeah. Configure and it'll align. Oh, I'm starting to remember this now, yeah. Okay. So, second trek, the trek back should be a lot easier. Um, 
data rates are intimidating, smug, and grossly arrogant. We are so insignificant in their eyes. It's oppressive and belittling. If they are as they claim, I no longer hold users in high regard. That mm. seems to be a common sentiment amongst us lower level programs. We are treated oh. like second rate lines of code. That's kind of interesting knowing uh, knowing a little bit of, knowing that little bit about uh about the data rates. Going to quick save again right here. I believe this one I think the pattern might be different. Is it? It's not. There we go. Knock that guy out so we don't have to worry about him. Got the second ring aligned. We've got one more ring to align, and we'll be good to go. For we're trying, well, we're trying to, yeah, we're trying to get into the into the F con so That's <coughs> okay. Two and three, we'll get those. I also apologize if I feel if I uh, sound a little out of it during the set during this session um like I'm having to talk uh, like I'm ha like because my nose my nose being stopped up I'm having to talk through my mouth I'm having to breathe through my mouth um and talk out of it at the same time so obviously not an easy thing to do um but here I believe you can step here and be okay Yep. Um, clearly, I'm not a. Uh, uh, I, clearly, I'm not a sniper material since I can't breathe through my skin, and that's. Uh, I was asking for that one, wasn't I? Um, topical, topical jokes and humor, right? Um, oh, oh, I guess that answered my question. Uh, I was just about to see if we could. If we could, uh... We're gonna take the risk on that. Uh, but yeah. So this is one of the joke I made of. Apparently in Metal Gear Solid 5, um, I've yet to play it. I've yet to play it myself. Um, and I'm really on some contention on whether or not I will, I will play it, simply because... Well... Chances are, if you're watching this video, then chances are you know about Konami's, uh... How should we put this? Desperate urge to burn every possible bridge they can burn... ...in the gaming industry. And... <coughs> that includes, uh... That includes probably the worst thing they've done this thus far this year, and it can be kind of hard to top it considering it's the end of the year. But considering that they banned Hideo Kojima, the creator of Metal Gear Solid Five, from attending a an award ceremony um, where his where his game was where his game Metal Gear Solid Five was. Nominated uh, for an award. So yeah, Hideo Kojima, the creator of Metal Gear Solid Five, and all other subs, uh, all other uh, subsequent Metal Gear games. Um, stuff to think for Vengeance. To think for Vengeance. All he had a part in it um, was dealt mostly by Platinum. Um, was not allowed to attend a a little. Gaming award ceremony. No, I guess it was a little. It's a pretty big deal for some reason. Um, and so, yeah. I don't know why they didn't allow him to do it, but they really should have. So he, so Hideo Kojima, the creator of Metal Gear Solid. 
Yeah. Some, 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 I, 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 I was thinking something else. I kind of lost track of what I was, think, of what I was thinking there. I'm, I apologize. <coughs> but for those of you wondering why I refer to, why I'm referring to, to the man like that, why I'm referring to Hideo Kojima's creator of Metal Gear Solid as Hideo Kojima's creator of Metal Gear Solid and not just the name is because, uh, Another little interesting tidbit, Konami doesn't like the fact that he made Metal Gear Solid, apparently. Like, they have done, they've gone out of their way in their, uh, in their, uh, not goodwill to not only strike his name from the game, but to pretty much ban anyone on YouTube who had... Or, or not, not ban anyone, but like delete their videos, take down their videos for anyone that had Hideo Kojima maker in Metal Gear Solid. I guess I guess either. I guess just a uh, Hideo Kojima um, in the, like in the title or something like that. Anyone talking about Hideo, Hideo Kojima creator of Metal Gear Solid um, and. They really, really did not want that fact to be known, apparently. Um, so yeah, so that's why whenever I'm referring to him, I'm referring to him as Hideo Kojima, the creator of Metal Gear Solid. Because, A, this is America, Konami, we're allowed to say stuff like that. Um, B, it's true. And C, come at me. Come at me, I dare you. Yeah. Uh, now that I, now that's happened, they probably will. And the next, and the messed up thing is, I won't be able to do a damn thing about it. Not that. Configuration terminal online. Not that it really matters in the, in the end anyway. Uh, okay, so here we have a little bit of. A, what do you, so this is gonna rotate rings one and three. So I believe. Okay. So you see the outer ring. I believe that's ring one. We want it like that, so that the beam here can transfer all the way through. So we want to move, oh, two and three. Three is the middle one. Okay, I gotcha. So let's, uh, whoa, thought that was supposed to. <sighs> Getting this all pre, uh, Pre done. So there you go. Perfect. So that should be one and two, right? So middle one's one. Okay. So it doesn't matter which one you hit, they're all gonna move in the same direction anyway. And why they don't just go ahead and do quarter turns instead of eight instead of one eighth turns, I don't know. So yeah, so we got that done. User packets, Alan. So he's in FCON, presumably. He's on the FCON servers now. So, yeah. Um, what else can I talk about since we're talking about a. No sweat. Actually, I uncovered some interesting information about if, if I'm doing this right, today the 29th, so, to, so this episode will probably go out the 31st. So yeah. Data rates um. Information over the net. Once launched, their activities. So yeah, hopefully, so hopefully, uh. We can't let them get away with this. My feelings exactly. So yeah, um. I think, I've, I think I've basically said everything I needed to say about that. Like, basically everything that's happened with Konami, like I can point you towards any number of respectable critics online, uh, or analysts, or whoever. Uh, Total Biscuit, Jim Sterling, Press Hard to Continue, Jesse Cox, anyone that's been on the Co-Optional Podcast, Mr. Baza, I just lost Alan. anyone that's 
been on YouTube for more than two seconds. Anyone that's on a credit in a credible gaming network, and perhaps it was foolish of you to send him, including Jeff Keeley, the uh, host of video, uh, the Video Game Awards, who actually brought us the bad news that Hideo Kojima could not accept his award in person, despite the fact that Konami probably was, was pretty bitter about him doing that. <coughs> So yeah. Wait here while I clear the area of danger. So yeah, um, with all that said, I think I'm gonna go ahead and end the episode off here for now. So in the next episode will be uh I'm gonna I can I can say over that it's gonna be pointless at this point to have plan B up. Uh there we go. Yeah, just in case something happens in between videos. So hopefully I'll be able to save this if that happens. So anyway, in the next episode we'll be uh, discovering a way to stop FCON. Uh, um, I'm not exactly sure what FCON has done. I think they, I think they, oh yeah, that's right. They want to completely control the control the net. That's right. Um, so yeah, we'll stop them from doing that. Until next time, I will see you guys later.